Hello and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today I want to do a test with a couple of builds. I finally got the Omomori and it seems like a super solid module. Actually I've already tested this out and it does help. Uh, this is like the ultimate res uh, damage resistance guy. Good lord I can't talk today. Anyways, uh, what I have is a couple of builds with the Ermac and the Omamuri, and it also has Grizzly on it. So they're like the ultimate resistance builds, and I want to test them out on camera and show you guys how resistant they really are. This one I've had a little trouble with. I don't know exactly why. I don't know if it's a higher power score or what. Um, but we'll test it out and we'll see. I have this and then I also have, uh, my Miller Mill, uh, Miller build. Good Lord. I cannot talk today. Uh, so pretty much I have the front Miller attached to the Omomori and, uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. This one seems to work a lot better, but, uh, I'll show you guys. We'll go ahead and we'll get into some gameplay. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you like my content and you want to see more videos. Uh, analytics show that 89% of viewers have not subscribed yet. So if you're a new viewer, feel free to subscribe. It would help me out a lot. I'm trying to grow and I do appreciate the support. Alright, well, I'd much rather play this than the last match we got. The last match we got was Rock City, and that's been turning out to be a shit show every single time. Anyways, Desert Valley. Let's see how this goes. I just... The only problem I feel like this build really has is the wheels. I feel like I should probably be rocking some uh, purple wheels instead of blue at this power score, but especially lately, because shit's been crazy lately on here. What's up with all the drones and turrets and shit? There we go, that was a solid hit. Base too. Oh come on, teammate! God damn it! Oh boy, a dragger build. That's not good. Okay, we fucked him up. Ooh, kind of knocked him silly there. That hover is going to be a problem. As you can see, though, we're taking all kinds of shit to the face. And... Ooh, we got the hover. Actually, I'm glad we got this cap can guy on our team. Okay, well, we hit him a little bit. Do you just... See how long we survived there? Like, holy shit, dude. We were getting hit, like, non-stop by stuff for, like, a, a solid 20 or 30 seconds. This guy was helping out a shit ton, though. Okie dokie. We are on Founders Canyon. This is a decent map for this build. Uh... Everyone gonna go hill or oops? We're gonna go to this side. The entire enemy team is going right side except for one or two. Well then, let's just lob one over the hill. 
Oh, God damn it, I hit my teammate. Always hitting my teammate with these things. Hey, buddy. We can facehug people with this build, too. Just like that. <laughs> Look at that. I barely took anything off. Hold on, teammate. I got you, bro. What just happened? I don't know. I kind of fucked that guy up, but... Oh, God. That's, that's not ideal. That's not ideal. Yeah, I definitely need better wheels for this build, but... Right now, I don't have any gold. I'm waiting on my new egg refund to get some gold. I'm also gonna probably be getting a webcam and a new mic. Like, a really good mic. So, that'll help out with video quality and everything, but... They are all over there. Bro, we need to, like, turn the fuck around. This guy's right on my ass. Look at that. Just face hug the shit out of that guy. He's not got much left now. God damn it, dude. Alright, well, I think that's enough for this build. I, it, it makes it look like I'm kicking myself in the ass for what I said, but it really, the extra durability really does help. We'll move on to the next one. Alright, so we are on Control 17 Station. Using the Millers this time. Massive Midget. Okay. I do want to try something with this build. I might lower the power score a little bit on it. Because I can swap out my purple radiators for the blue ones that I have. Get wrecked, buddy. Took a lot of effort to take that guy out. That was a big Chongus spider. Alright, we'll do one more with this build, and then I'll do some testing, maybe. <coughs> Show you guys the difference in how long it takes to rip something off or do something to something. With Omomorion. Alright, we are on Nameless Tower. The tower 
be quite nameless, my guy. Move it or lose it, talkers. They are all rushing middle. See, we still got our weapons. Get rid of these annoying ass pots. tried. We got a couple. Alright, so let's go ahead and do some testing and I'll show you the difference between having the Omomori and not having it. I stop shooting. So, as you see guys, it really does make a big difference having the Omomori on. I know the game plays didn't really show it any justice, but hopefully this short testing here shows you that it really does make a difference. But, if you don't have the Battle Pass, I highly suggest testing it out yourself, seeing how you like it, and purchasing it or whatever. Or, if you have the Battle Pass, and you're not sure whether it's any good or not, or you can't tell the difference, there's your proof right there. So, anyways, this is Anubis Tekken Games, and I'll catch you on the next one.